Hello everyone, my name is Menno Verbeek and today I'm going to show you about our new product, the VP Flowscope M. The VP Flowscope M is a thermal flow meter that measures flow, pressure and temperature simultaneously. The VP Flowscope M comes with a revolutionary sensor cartridge. You can now simply exchange the cartridge just like you would do with a clogged filter. So all you need to do is order a new sensor cartridge which comes in this small container. You just take it out from the container, go to your flow meter and exchange it on the spot. So let's have a closer look at the different models. Here we have a VP Flowscope M start kit. So in this kit we have a VP sensor cartridge with a locking ring, a safety cable, a compression fitting with integrated safety mechanism, a display with data logger, a power supply and a Modbus TCP or Ethernet cable. All these items you'll need just to get started and get going and start reading all your parameters from your compressed air system. All of this in this waterproof and rugged case. The transmitter comes in three models. We have a non-display model, a display model and a display with integrated data logger. The sweet thing about the data logger model is that you can put it in two modes. It's the cyclic mode or the traditional start-stop mode. When you choose for a cyclic mode, all you need to do is just start recording and all your parameters will be locked. It will lock for six months and more, so you do not have to worry about running out of data. Alright, now let's put this flow meter together. It's not rocket science, it's going to be real easy. So take the cartridge, take the locking ring, slide the cartridge through the locking ring, then take your compression fitting with the safety cable, slide the probe into the compression fitting, Make sure that the safety cable goes through the locking ring and then a very important step, make sure that this knot falls into this slot and you'll hear it click once it's firmly mounted. Then move up the locking ring and you're ready to connect the transmitter. So let's do it. Take the transmitter, screw the locking ring on top of the transmitter and you're done. We've now seen that assembling the Flowscope M is really easy and inserting it is just as easy and safe. So I pre-mounted it on top of this ball valve and I'm going to show you how I'm going to slide it in. Loosen the compression fitting a bit so the flow meter can go up and down. Open the ball valve, pressure inside the pipe would like to force the flow meter out, the safety cable is in place, it's not going anywhere. We're sliding it in, let it touch the bottom, go half a diameter up, tighten your compression fitting, Use a wrench in the field to tighten it even more. Make sure that the safety cable has no slack. That's very important. Turn this little wheel to make sure that the locking me mechanism is locked. You're now ready to program the diameter, hit the record button and go home. Thank you for watching and make sure you order your Flowscope M start kit today. Stay tuned for more videos and our special offer.